Key witness in Donald Trump's hush money trial wrapped up her testimony today. The defense cross-examined adult film star Stormy Daniels. And WGN Shannon Halligan is live in the newsroom with the latest on that. Shannon. Yeah, in response to Daniel's testimony today, Trump's attorneys asked the judge to modify the gag order so he could publicly respond. The defense attorneys also requested a mistrial. Judge Mershon rejected both. As Donald Trump left the courthouse Thursday, he lashed out at the judge in his hush money case. Thank you very much. Everybody saw what happened today. I don't think we have to do any expl explaining. I'm not allowed to anyway because this judge is corrupt. He's a corrupt judge. This judge, what he did and what his ruling was is a disgrace. Judge Mershon denied requests by Trump's lawyers to modify the gag order so he could respond to Stormy Daniels' testimony. Daniels, the former adult film star, spent seven and a half hours on the stand over two days. The porn actor recounted the alleged 2006 sexual encounter with the former president. During questioning, she relayed in graphic detail what she said happened after the two met at a celebrity golf outing in Lake Tahoe. It was this encounter that she said she was eventually paid to keep quiet about during the 2016 presidential election. In her final day on the stand, Daniels fired back at Trump's attorneys. They sought to paint Daniels as a liar and extortionist who was trying to take down Trump after drawing money and fame. Prosecutors say payments were made to former Trump attorney Michael Cohen, who paid Daniels $130,000 to keep quiet. Because of the gag order, Trump is limited in what he can say publicly, but he's getting help from some GOP allies who showed up to talk, including Florida Senator Rick Scott. This can't continue. What's happening to this president is wrong. Trump is charged with 34 counts of falsifying internal Trump Organization business records. He denies he ever had sex with Daniels. I got to get back on the campaign trail. I'm not supposed to be here. We are so innocent. There's never been anything like it. Today's testimony is billed up to the prosecution's star witness, Michael Cohen, who arranged the payments to Daniels. He later went to prison for orchestrating the payments and other charges. The trial is set to resume tomorrow. Live in the newsroom, Shannon Halligan, WGN News. Thank